Big changes, big changes on this 1978 Chevy C10 Papaw truck. Let's walk around. What are you grinning for? Because <laughs> I'm kind of happy. You're happy. I am happy. When was the last time you was happy? I'm always happy. <laughs> oh Surprise! Ta-da! Or as Mrs. Mrs. P.I.B. does. What do you think? This is the same color that we used on the 75 C10 truck sky. We went from the dark shade of blue to this uh, uh, satin island splash i think that's the name of it we got a we got five cans at the hobby lobby and uh we have more cans coming from sherwin williams yes but uh, it'll be two weeks tell them what they said at Sh sherwin williams that it's paints a short oh i called actually i called krylon and they said they're having a hard time getting supplies in to make the paint oh okay hard time getting supplies okay Anyway, what do you think? Now, all the dark shade of blue will be this color instead of the dark blue. Let's look at this one more time. I, I should have gave you a heads up so you would know what you were looking at in case you're a new person to my channel. Th this is what I painted. Painted this white, and I had a, a YouTube subscriber that commented, and, and I'm glad they pointed this out because they thought this section in here was white. It's it's light blue. It's kind of hard to tell, isn't it? Especially here under this tree in the shade. But I've painted this white. I'm trying to get, I'm trying to make it kind of pop. Now, I like this dark shade of blue, but there's something about this dark shade of particular uh, particular blue that neither one of us liked, did we? Not really. So, uh, we tried to. Yeah, we tried to. We even went down the street and turned around and come back to see if we locked it. It looks good the further back you get. Down at the bottom of the street, <laughs> it looks real good. But Okay, she says I'm telling one. But no, seriously, when we come up the street from going to the store or whatever to get milk or whatever, it uh, it didn't look too bad. But I must admit, I like this. I like this much better. It looks better on this truck. Now, if you're wondering about this down here, I don't have any trim for this long bed at, from here and on the tailgate too. I'm missing that trim. I don't know what's happened to it, but somewhere along the life of this truck, somebody's changed beds and the trim is gone. So I come up with this piece right here. You can go back on my videos and I'll show you how I put this trim on. And a lot of people's going to get mad at me, but the the holes were already in the trim so all i done was put screws there it already it already been screwed on before so i need that trim down here to make it look better but so what i'm fixing to do now is spray paint the passenger side just like i did this driver's side here with krylon uh island island splash I hope it's the same as this satin island splash. I'm hoping. It's just what? No, different ounces? Oh, okay. I'm going to give it a shot here and we'll see what it looks like. So just hang on with me. Okay, guys, I have not took the tape off of this yet. Just letting it dry for a few minutes. And uh, I got to tell you, I like this color much better, and Mrs. P.I.B. does too. I just like it better. I gotta tell you though, this when they say 25% more on, on Krylon for free, whatever, man, that makes a big difference when you're painting. Cause I took this one, it took one can to do, uh, and I was trying to go sparingly, uh, you know, the top and the bottom down here. I still got to do the tailgate. And, uh, 
and of course you know the rest of the truck I keep doing the same spots over and over I apologize for that but I gotta tell you I'm much happier with this color it, to me it makes the white look brighter to me I don't know anyway uh, boy I, I really finished this one off so I'll be glad when I get I, how many more cans do I have four I got I got four more cans I don't really know how much four cans will do it might let's see I might be able to get the the, the cab where's my finger the cab the door and the fenders you know maybe with one can I'm hoping because this is a long stretch right through here and uh, of course I got to do the white as well so there's still quite a bit to do but uh anyway let me know what you think about this color I, I don't mean to bore y'all to death I truly don't but even when I was painting that that other shade of blue and I'd really just got it because that if they'd have had more selection I probably wouldn't have picked that color but I was going on how many cans do you have of that particular dark blue that I had on there this shade so now but I like this much better I think it's going to turn out good and it'll look uh, of course I still got to do the same as I said before I got to take the camper cover off paint all that and up in here around the the cab I'm this of course this will all be white white is not so hard to come by it's the dang uh, colors you know so I don't know I guess the everybody being off work and stuff has got everybody behind so I'm hoping that it all come around and I'll work out good I'm sure it will just have to be patient y'all have a wonderful day I thank you for watching the videos and keeping up with this old papa truck it's a pretty good old truck seems like and uh don't forget i got a second youtube channel called man on a budget i'm on instagram primer is best of course this is what you're watching on youtube now primer is best and i have an instagram man on a budget one i'm also on facebook primer is best if you would like to Subscribe to my YouTube channel YouTube channel, excuse me, and tell your friends or anybody that's interested in C10 trucks, you know. I'm I'm not claiming I know anything, but I just like playing around with them. But to me that looks that looks much better. And it maybe be a twin to my seventy five C ten uh sky. So hopefully it's all gonna work out good. Y'all stay safe. God bless y'all. Thank you for watching my videos. And y'all stay safe. I'll catch you in the next one. See you later.